if you have been using the internet you probably must have seen a video with the dark or white or any color of background and in today's video i'm going to show you how you can achieve that inside davinci resolve so without further ado let's dive into it first thing you want to do is go to effects drag and drop an adjustment clip we need an adjustment clip because with an adjustment clip what you do to the adjustment clip applies to all the clips below the adjustment clip so right click on your adjustment clip and open in fusion page in the fusion page you have something like this so get a rectangle mask and connect it to your media in like that increase the length and the width of your rectangle to about how you want it to be for me that's okay increase the corner radius to about 0.20 if you go back to your edit edit page you're going to see you have something like this but if you want to change the, the background color to white like i have here go back to the fusion page get a background node connect a background node to your media in one like this select you see that you have black everything is black even the video select your merge node and go to operator select under good now you can change the background color to red green or white go back to your edit page if you want to add this text like i did you can get a text go to title select text bring it to your timeline make it about the size of your video clip and in that go to inspector and type your right you want to in this case it doesn't give you doesn't give you i'm going to change the font to mozart and i'm going to change this to about bold increase the size to about like that go to media go to layout and increase now you can see that we can't see the text we go back to text and go to color change the color to black now you can see the text if you want another text like the liberation down here duplicate this text and put it above bring it to where he says the word liberation here in this one you just type in this one you type type liberation change it to extra bold italic go to layout and put bring it all the way down extra board italic now if you want to achieve this kind of blur effect you go to your first text and open infusion page let's say for example you want the text to blur at frame 30 search for shift space Gaussian blur you see it as it is blur here reduce the blur the blur strength a little bit to about there if you want it to blur at frame 30 keyframe the value and go five frames before that's frame 25 and take the strength value all the way down you see go to spline select zoom to zoom to fit select all now you can go back to your edit page and if you play that you will see that good you see that it blurs so that's it for this video guys if you learned something from the video give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to the channel i will see you in the next one thanks for watching